Hi! Welcome back to Eye of the Beholder painting tutorials. This is going to be my first episode in a series of painting all of the minis from the board game Ankh. I got it as a gift for Christmas and it has some really pretty minis that I wanted to work through on video. I'm also going to try to buy all the expansions and paint their minis as well, but I'm still very broke so let's wait on that one. I'm beginning with the most boring and basic minis in the game, which is the 30 camels. There's literally nothing special about them, they're just camels. But I thought I'd do a video on them anyway. I started by basing the skin tone. For my shadows, I made a light mix of Talaran Sand and Doombull Brown, then used a mid-tone of Talaran Sand, and then it highlighted heavily with Talaran Sand mixed with Screaming Skull. You'll see that I have five camels on my makeshift holder here, and that's just because there are five different types of camels in the miniatures, and I wanted to showcase one of each sculpt. I painted all the other camels off screen. Once I put down the skin tone, I was actually pretty happy with it. They're a little brighter than I expected, but they look camel enough to me. Here you can see my current progress of my off-screen camels, and they look pretty good. But here you can see how my fiancés work with them. They like painting with me, so I asked if they wanted to take some of the camels of their own to paint, and they're doing a fantastic job, and I am incredibly impressed all the time. Anyway, between this recording session and the last, I thought the camels should have a little more color variation. So I made two new skin tone gradients. One that goes from Rhinoxide to Bane Blade Brown, then highlighted with Screaming Skull, and another that goes from Rhinoxide plus Talaran Sand, then highlighted with more Talaran Sand, and then highlighted with Screaming Skull as well. They're similar, but distinct enough for me. Once all the skin was done for good, I dotted in the eyes with pure black. Now for the colors! I wasn't sure what tones to use for what, but my fiancé pointed out that the gods that you play as in the game each have a primary color associated with them, so I just used those. The colors are red, orange, a palish green, blue, and a lilac. I started with red by using my regular tones of corn red, mephiston red, and then a little troll slayer orange. For all of the colors used, I just chose one thing on each camel and painted that. I also made sure that for each of the camels of the same sculpt, that almost nothing was painted the same color other than metallics. For my oranges, I made a light base by mixing Doombull Brown into some Scrag Brown, and then highlighted in two tones with Trolls Layer Orange. Thank you. 
Moving straight onto the green, I based it in wah flesh, and then I used pure straken green followed by pure nurgling green. My blue was a base of Cantor blue, and then two brighter tones mixed using Lothurn blue. All of these colored tones are on very small areas, so I tried to maximize contrast as best as I could while also making the brightest tone match the associated god. And finally, the purple was based in Negaroth Knight, then highlighted like the blue using Slanesh Grey. For any obvious fabric or luggage areas I didn't get with the basic colors, I mixed a Rhinox side to Doombill Brown to Baneblade Brown to fill in any loose areas. I then also used this color for all the wooden things like the loot, the boxes, the frame, and the strapped logs. This did leave a surprising amount unpainted, but I still had like a hundred colors I hadn't used. But what I did next was metallics. For anything gold that I found, I based it in Warplock Bronze before giving it some bright Retributor Gold highlights.
Anything that I wanted bronze, I also based in Warplock Bronze, but instead highlighted it in Balthazar Gold. For Silver Metallics, they're based in Iron Warriors and highlighted with Iron Hand Steel. And at this point, any spot that I hadn't painted yet, I just kind of threw Talaran Sand highlighted with Screaming Skull on it and called it a day just because I feel like it. Once all that was finished, I lined all of the strings, reins, and harnesses on them with black. There were a couple camels with fancy headdresses on, and they got a special treatment of Balthazar Gold and or Retributor Gold just so they can feel good about themselves. And there we are! A short and simple camel video. But now it's on to the Guardians next, because the Guardians look cool as hell! So stay tuned for the rest of the miniatures from Ankh! I'm really, really excited to be doing this series, and I hope to do more things like this in the future, so please let me know what you think! Either way, thank you so much for watching. Bye!